Turbin. Welcome to the White Turbin Academy. I'm Mrs Gaston, your Director of Learning. We are thoroughly looking forward to welcoming you here on Thursday the 3rd of September. It's really important to us to ensure you are safe, happy and ready to learn. The purpose of this video is to talk you through what to expect and how things will be at the start of your time. Don't worry about remembering everything as we will make sure that we're here to support you. We hope that it's helpful and answers your questions. Inevitably, there will still be other questions that you have, but don't worry, during your first two days, we will make sure that you have all the information that you need. The most important thing about everything we do is that we all take responsibility for our own hygiene and actions. If we respect each other's space and keep ourselves and the spaces around us clean and tidy, then we will help reduce risk. Year 11 were absolutely brilliant at following expectations when we were open last term, so we are confident that we can get this right. It is about working together. I'm now going to go through some useful information for you. You'll already have had a letter explaining about equipment and uniform. You need to wear the full school uniform. PPE. As a trust, we've followed guidance nationally and are happy to have updated our policy on personal protective equipment or PPE. As students, you are now welcome to wear a mask that you bring if you're comfortable with this. It is your choice. Obviously, if you are travelling on public transport, then you must wear a mask on the transport. Throughout the school and in classrooms in particular, there are opportunities to sanitise your hands. It's important that you wash your hands for 20 seconds after using the toilets. The bubble concept and entries. The government have advised secondary schools to have year group bubbles. Consequently, we have organised your timetable and school day to fit these, including where you enter the site and your area. One of the really exciting things that started to happen is our new building. One challenge this presents, however, is that we don't have access to the car park. Your parents and carers must not use the staff car park as there simply isn't space. So if you are going to be dropped off at school by your parents, we're delighted that we've been supported by our local community in being able to use the Mayfield car park. So if you arrive with your parents, they must drive you in this way, you park up, drop off and then leave by the blue exit sign. If you are using the car park, you must remember that it is a one-way system. So if you go beyond this point, you must carry on down and follow the one-way system out of school. Whether walking to school, arriving by bus or coming by car, all students in your group must enter via the main gate. At Whitehaven, we are splitting students between the two gates and different doors to help flow around the school to avoid congestion and support the year group bubble system. So, you will enter and leave via this main gate. It is entirely up to you whether you remove your mask if you've used one coming to school or if you keep it on. You should then do one of three things. Firstly and ideally, you will walk straight to your year group area, which is through this main gate, up to maps. Or you may go to the East Canteen to pay a pair of pay. Thirdly, you may go to the toilet. But don't worry, on your first day there will be staff who will show you where to go. On your first day, we will have all the Year 7 students in the sports hall, which is a big space for us to sort you all out easily. It's really important that you do not walk around into other areas. You should only go to your year zone, your social space and your designated toilets. For students in the T-band, lots of your lessons will happen in the technology block. Don't worry, we will show you where that is. As the term progresses, and you will have some science lessons in science rooms. In addition, your creative subjects like food and art will also happen in their usual spaces. Your tutor group will be here in the maths block in the morning. The tutor groups are in the following rooms. It is really important that you do not walk around into other areas 
you should only go into your own year zone, your social space and your designated toilets. Your year group will not be using the canteen for lunch or break. Instead, you will be in the sports hall. This means that if you want to pay money into pay and pay via the machine, you will need to do this at the start or the end of the day. Ideally, we encourage parents to pay into pay and pay online rather than the school. But if you need to pay money in, please do so at the start or end of the school day. You should enter via the West One door. You should queue following social distancing guidelines. Before you use the machine, you must use this hand sanitizer. When you've paid your money in, you must then use the machine again and sanitize your hands. You should then leave via this door. You must not sit down in the canteen area. The cleaners will have cleaned this space for students to use for their break or lunch time. Your break time is 10.20 to 10.40. This means that you will go straight from period one. Then at 10.40, you will go to your period two lesson for an hour's lesson. Don't worry, to begin with, staff on duty will remind you. Please be aware that the school canteen will not be selling food or drinks at break time. You will need to bring your own food and drink. Please remember that you must not bring energy drinks, fizzy drinks or any food containing nuts. At break time, you may either go to your designated social space, which is the sports hall, or the upper courts. Toilets. It is really important that we think carefully about hygiene with toilets. We have brought in additional toilets. There are now two additional blocks outside. These two blocks will be for the boys. The two blocks inside will now be for girls only. Each year group now have their designated toilets. It is essential that we keep to this. Year 7. Your lunch time is 11.45 to 12.15. This means that you will go straight from period 2 to period 3. After your 30 minute lunch, you will go to your period 3. Year 8. Your lunch time is at 12.45 to 1.15. This means that you will go straight from period 2 to period 3. After your one hour lesson, you will go to lunch. Your social area is in the upper basketball courts. Hand sanitizer is in your lunch area for you to use before eating. When you go to lunch, if you have a packed lunch, you can sit down and eat. If you are purchasing lunch, you will need to queue up as normal. If you are buying food, you simply choose your food and proceed to the tills. It is up to you as to whether you wish to use a pin number, this will be shared with you, or you can use the scanner for your fingerprint. This will be explained to you and you would use the sanitizer before and afterwards. Don't worry, new students will be given a PIN number and have their fingerprints taken on the first day. This will be done with students using sanitizer to ensure it is hygienic. Once you've finished your lunch, you can remain seated. You may be asked to move if eating space is required. In order to help with the flow out the building, your year group and year eight will finish at three o'clock, five minutes before the other year groups. You will leave via the main gate that you came in. If you are going by bus, then you will queue and should have your mask on whilst you're waiting for the bus.